Well, hello again. Um, let me have a sip of mocha. And welcome to this um, very wonderful um, lockdown Sunday morning on the 5th of April uh, 2020. Um, I'm very lucky because I've got a garden I can I can sit in, but I, um, I do sympathise with those of you who are watching who are maybe confined at home or into a flat or other situation. Um, the other day I thought it would be nice to see what goes on in the garden. Now our, this garden is actually situated um, uh, about, uh, um, what have I got, 120 metres from the actual house. So there's no way you can see it from the house. But what I did was this, and that was um, ordered a V380 IP camera uh, off Amazon and I fixed it on onto the side of the, uh, onto the, side of the um, fence. Um, so that uh, I could see everything that's going on from the comfort of the house. Now during the day when you're up here you don't see an awful lot because things stay away. You might see the odd bird. Um, but at night, well that's a different matter. So this video is not going to be about tech, it's not going to be about books. It's going to be about uh, the, um, the wildlife that occurs at night and during the day when we're absent in the garden. And um, I just wanted to share some of the things with you. There's going to be a fox. Uh, we have a regular visit from uh, a badger. Um, uh, a number of squirrels come to visit, apart from the birds and the odd domestic cat. So uh, that's the kind of things it's going to be in the, in the video. Now you may have noticed I've got um, Winston Churchill's um, The Second World War, Volumes 1, 2 and 3. I've got all the volumes, but I couldn't carry everyone. All, all the rest of them up here. So I thought at this time when the Queen is going to make a speech tonight uh, regarding social um, social coherence and solidari solidarity um, and how to keep our heads held high in this period um, that maybe I would read that. At least it keep me occupied for a few months. Hopefully we're not going to go on that long. Anyway, <laughs> that's just a little aside. I thought it would be appropriate. Um, so let's get on and look at the video and uh, we'll um, have a look at some of the activities that occur in the garden. Um, I'm going to have another sip of coffee and I want you to enjoy. Thank you. 
Well, there we go. That's the video. Thank you for watching. Um, quite an interesting uh, range of um, wildlife activity takes place, doesn't it, at night? Um, haven't seen any hedgehogs. Uh, have seen the occasional frog and things come out, but uh, they weren't on this on this video. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you're staying safe. Um, you notice I've replaced uh, Winston Churchill's books um, with uh, Gibbons, uh, Edward Gibbons, The History of the Decline and Fall of the Roman Empire, volumes 1, 2, 3 and 4. I have volumes 5, 6, 7 and 8, but again, couldn't carry them all up here. Um, I don't know whether the decline and fall of the Roman Empire is quite appropriate. Maybe we should have stuck to uh, Churchill's... Uh, Churchill's Second World War. Anyway, <laughs> hope it's not the decline and fall of, um, of our empire. I'm sure it's not, and we're all going to get through this uh, very, very successfully. So until the next video, um, stay safe, and uh, hope, um, hope you keep well, and uh, I'll be back with you again soon. But as always, take care.